Hi, it's Paul from wave5trade.com. I wanted to give you a quick video tour of the new version of our Elliott Wave Indicator Suite for the Thinkorswim, NinjaTrader, TradeStation and Multicharts platforms. I'm going to use the NinjaTrader as an example, but all of the platforms respond pretty much exactly the same. Um, the new version goes out on the 1st of May 2018 and the new retail price will be $449. Now, if you buy before the 1st of May, you will get a discount on the current retail price. So you'll buy it for $349 instead of $399. And that's a $100 discount on the new price. And you will get a lifetime license. So when you buy it now, you will get that free upgrade on the 1st of May to version 3, which has all the new stochastic tools and strategies that I'm going to talk about in a minute. So when the video is finished, you've looked at the video tour, go down below here, choose your particular trading platform, click on to watch the video tour there, and you can purchase the indicator suite there. This is a video tour of the Wave 5 Trade Elliott Wave indicator suite for the Ninja Trader NT8 platform. All the other platforms, Think or Swim, TradeStation, and Multicharts behave pretty much the same. So let's go through. This is a um, stock. I'm going to go through a Forex pair. I'm going to go through a futures pair on different time frames just to show you how uh, valuable this indicator suite is. So first of all, this is SRPT on the daily time frame. It's a stock. I've isolated uh, the Elliott Wave count down at the low down here and the indicator suite has automatically assigned the Elliott wave count one here two three the wave four has pulled back into our automated probability zones so green is 85 percent amber is 80 percent and the red zone is 75 percent probability it's going to go on and make a new wave five high into our automated target zone up here as you can see currently in this trade and this is where we are right now Below the chart, we have a 535 oscillator. This helps build the picture of this wave four pullback and the probability. We look for a pullback between 90 and 140% of the highest point on wave three, which happened in this case. Below that, we've got a special false breakout stochastic. So the yellow dots on the overbought zone at the top here denote a very strong bullish trend so the stochastic has uh, had false breakouts now it's pulled back against that strong bullish trend and into the oversold zone on the way four and then the probability is it wants to return it's like an elastic band it wants to return back to that overall strong bullish trend so you see we've got the picture we've got the way four pull back into the probability zone We've got uh, confirmation that that behaved well with the 535 oscillator and the false bar stochastic. We get a green arrow indication here. Plus also we've got our 6.4 moving average high, the, the green moving average here for our conservative entry strategy and the 6.4 moving average low for entry strategies for the short. So that's an example of a stock on a daily time frame. So let's go to GBP US dollar on a 60 minute time frame. Behaves exactly the same way. We have the Elliott wave count over here on the left. We have the wave one, then we have a wave two, the wave three, and then a sharp wave four pullback into the amber zone. So that's an 80% probability. That's going to go on and make a new wave five high into our automated target zone, which it did. To back that up, at the point of the wave four, we see the 535 oscillators pulled back between 90 and 140%. And to back that up even further, the stochastic has pulled back against the false breakout dots here into the oversold zone, and it will want to return to the overall bullish trend. So again, we've built this picture of this high probability bullish move, this fifth wave move, which is the highest probability move in a trend. So that's GBP US dollar and exactly the same sort of thing on futures. This is ES. This is a short. So we're going the other way this time. So we can see the, from the highs here on the five minute chart, this is we've had a wave one, a wave two, a wave three. We've got a very complex wave four, but it's found resistance in the red zone. So the 75% probability is going to go on and make a new wave low at the same time. 
we have the 535 oscillator pulling back between 90 and 140%. And we have the stochastic crossing over in the oversold zone against these false uh, breakout dots here and as you can see there was an entry below the 64 moving average low here we see the red arrow entry here and the short went on and hit the wave 5 target spot on so that's a quick tour of the Elliott wave indicator suite for the wave 5 trade um, and ninja trader version also don't forget we have the think or swim trade station and multi charts versions thank you